Welcome to race 28, there's Lingfield Stays Handicap, 2 miles north of 70. Six runners, headed by Constant Threat, Paul Rhodes, unusual to see him in a north 70 handicap, but we have, and he'll be a threat to every single horse in this race. Trade friend Matt Cooper, Lazat Martin Leiden, and Dyson Boom. The upset is Martin Leiden, lost that daddy, Alex Cherry, and I'm free of Matt Cooper. Martin, not happy that. Dance the room was due to have a walk over in race 19. It didn't happen because the race cut. Kit won't do a walk over, so we'd have to put him into this race. That's the way things are, Martin. Premier League or oh, conference. You can't run up a horse or walk over on the race kit. Constant threat will be a threat to every single horse, even dance to the room in second. On the in middle of these is Jade Femme with the last time out. Star Daddy has been around the yard, around the block a few times. Afina and the Zat. Which is what Martin was hoping to win this race with originally. He's not got two chances along with Martin Cooper. So a mile and a half over, just over, on the Linkfield track ahead of them. A uh, constant threat leads by a couple. In second place, dance to the room. Jade Fern coming through on the inside to kick second now. And Fina is in between those pair. A little bit wider. Dadelli. That's that. It's going to come late. The run is just right there, right behind them. So the five behind the leader, well bunch five. That's constant threat leads by a couple of lengths. Jade Fern in second. You don't see poor old gentleman has done this far uh, in the league, but obviously a stable has had a few problems and is now trying to get back, trying to get back to the top I suppose. He'll be, he'll be ready for February March next year, the league will be only four weeks after this one finish. We'll have a four week break, give everybody a break because probably will be the last then league for SO7 hopefully SO8 will be out in February, March time we have one more league of SO7 before we think ahead into the year for another league season in the new SO8 a constant threat leads by left arm dance to the river in second Athena back in third Jade Fem four does that I've already ridden along that over here now. They're coming towards the five marker. Constant face. Made all so far. Two lives clear. Dance through the ribbon. Let's go and try and re make amends for missing out on a pot in race 19. On a walk over. He's trying to close him down in second. Last night, he's still a companion. He's moving on the outside. But Fina into third. And then Jay Trem and Stardelli is still about Margaret swinging in. And the constant threat has quickened. Further away, I think, falling, so maybe to dance the room in second. You're inside the three, but plenty of things can change. And in this link, Linkfield run in, yeah, we've watched the jumps on Linkfield a lot. What can happen on the one in at Linkfield on the jumps? And a constant threat leads by a couple from dance the room in second. Back in for Lazar, the stud, then Jade Fem and Anfina. But he's holding on to his lead, his constant threat. He's not, he doesn't look does not like he's stopping. And the weight's not going to stop him because the jockey's stop riding him now. He's eased down. He's got a couple of his stars and he's plugging his way into second. Behind these into his last set, dancing the women. He's not going to make up for that Mr. Ace in fourth. And the Afrina and Chief for him, fifth and sixth. Cost of threat, I thought he'd be a threat to him from the poor world stable. And probably the last time you'll see him in the North 70. Stardelli back in second. And Martin, leading pair, third and fourth. 